Welcome to another Impact Media tutorial. In this tutorial, we're going to demonstrate how to set up an email account in Microsoft Entourage for Mac. If you haven't done so already, please open Entourage. And to add a new account, we go up to Tools and then Accounts. You'll notice here we already have an email account in here and we would like to add an additional one. So we go to New and then Mail Account. Keep this selection on Pop and press OK. Now the account name is used internally in the system for reference. So for example, we have James Greenaway here, you might put John Smith. Or it could be sales, inquiries, accounts, etc. In the name again, this will be the name that the people or the recipients see when you're writing the email. And we will put John Smith. And we'll place in the email address john.smith at yourdomain.com. You will generally replace the yourdomain.com with obviously your domain name. So it could be mycarpentryservices.co.uk or something along those lines. Account ID in this case is the email address. So type this in again john.smith at yourdomain.com. Now the pop server is mail, M A I L, dot yourdomain.com. And then obviously you place the password in that's sent with your password sheet. Keep this selected, saving the password, and now we move on to the SMBT mail server. Please place mail.yourdomain.com in here as well. But this time, click here for advanced sending options, and we want to tick override default SMTP port and place in 587. Select SMTP required as authentication and select use same settings as incoming mail server. Then drop back and just as an extra tick on options and tick leave a copy of messages on the server, delete messages after 10 days and delete messages from the server after they are deleted from this computer. Now you don't have to do this but it helps if you're using your email on more than one device i.e. a laptop, computer or mobile device this way you will receive the emails on each device. Drop back into account settings and make sure every element on there is correct, i.e. the email address, the account ID, the mail server and the password and obviously the outgoing mail server. If any of these are incorrect or typed incorrectly you will not be able to send or receive emails. After this select OK and continue to add more email addresses if you have more than one, i.e. sales info accounts or click your red cross and start sending and receiving mail. This is another tutorial by Impact Media. Thanks very much.